Steve and today we're going to do a how-to session and it's going to be how to clean the Magikarp Rio, Rio 2, Rio 2E printers and as always we're going to do the bad photo ID of the day. Um, before I get started with the how-to session um, I want to talk a little bit about these printers. This is the Magikarp Rio, Rio 2 and Rio 2E. The 2 was the second version, the 2E was with Ethernet. Um, they're all discontinued, um, but Magikarp supports their printers for four to five years after the last one is made, as long as parts are available. And we can help you beyond that point a lot of times with our tech support here. Um, and the, the ribbons and supplies are still available for these, so call us and we can get you, get you those. We have the best pricing in the industry and um, just pick up the phone and give us a call or, or shoot us an email. Um, so we can repair these and keep them going for you. Um, so just, again, call us and let us know how we can help you. So let's get started on our how-to, and it's going to be how to clean these printers, the Magikarp Rio and Rio 2 and Rio 2E. And we got Kyle from our tech department that's going to show us how to do this. Thanks, Steve. All right. So uh, cleaning these printers, really simple. Um, you're going to go ahead and remove the ribbon and cards. So we'll go ahead and do that now. Um, so all your operations for cleaning this is going to be actually from behind the printer. Um, so maybe if you have this in a corner at your desk, you know, it might be best to bring it out and turn it around. Um, that way you can actually see where you're putting the cleaning cards and what buttons you need to push. Um, in order to clean this, you need to have the lid open. And the button that we're looking for actually gets covered. It's this little button right here. As I just pushed it, now it's requesting cards. On the front of the screen, it's you know stating, hey, it's time to clean. Um, we're gonna go ahead and insert our cleaning card. Uh, this card comes from our kit 36330053. Um, comes with 10 cleaning cards and a uh, print head cleaning pen. Um, so we're going to go ahead and tear one of these open. These are alcohol saturated, so um, the second that they're exposed to air, uh, they start drying out. So wait till the last minute to open these. Um, but we're going to go ahead and open the lid, push that little black button, and insert the card right above these rollers. It's going to take the card in, clean it, and spit it back out. Now if you noticed, um, like these rollers right here, um, might be a little hard to see on this camera, but it's, it's more like a brown and not a black on like these ones. Um, this brown actually indicates that the rollers actually have dirt on them. Um, the black marks are actually, it means that the rollers are clean and that's just rubber leaving residue on the cleaning card. If you notice that, you know, a lot of the rollers are brown, you know, the little marks, you can flip the card over and go ahead and push our little black button again. It will take the card in and run another little cleaning cycle on it. and our rollers are much cleaner now. You can go ahead and throw those away. Um, now we'll go to clean the print head. Um, so the print head is this little bar right here um, that's exposed. It's kind of like a gunmetal gray. Um, you're going to take this pen, pull the cap off. It is uh, alcohol saturated as well. Um, as long as the cap's on it and it's sealed, it'll stay moist. Um, when you pull the cap off, that's when it starts kind of drying out, so you have to do this quickly. Um, you're just going to run this pen right across the print head, just back and forth a couple of times, and you're done. Um, give that a few seconds to dry, as it is, uh, they, it does have uh, alcohol in it, 
And if you go ahead and put your ribbons back in and close it and print, uh, you have the potential of catching your machine on fire, which is no good. Uh, so another thing to look at too is there is a cleaning cartridge right here. Uh, it's it's spring loaded, so you have to push it down and pull out. And this is the cleaning roller that gets changed right here. This should come with every ribbon that you have. Uh, you'll just swap this out. You just put it back in, and that's spring loaded to push it down. And that just picks up the dirt that's on the face of the cards, if there is any. To insert it, it's pretty easy. You just put it back down in, push down, and in it goes. You can go ahead and load your ribbons and your cards back in, and you can continue printing. All right. Thanks, Kyle. And as promised, here's the bad photo ID of the day. And while you're looking at that, um, if you have any questions, submit them to us at our Facebook page at IDEdge.com. And if you have any, anything we can help you with as far as service or supplies, like on this, we have the best pricing in the industry, just give us a call at 800-798-3343 or go to our website, IDEdge.com.